the catchphrase with Andrew O'Connor. Welcome to Family Catchphrase. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and welcome to the show. This morning, this afternoon, this evening, we... What? I'm a bit confused. I want it, you see. You see, we make these shows, and we don't know when they're going to go out. You see? So the producer just cuts out the bits that don't work. All right? Bon matin, bonjour, bonjour, et bienvenue, our Family Catchphrase. Please welcome the contestants. The very strong, firm handshake, Jonathan. Good man. Sally, tell me all about him. Well, this is Jonathan. He's my nephew. He's 16 years old. He's recently passed nine GCSEs. His hobbies are... Hold on, hold on. Just nine of them? Nine of them. What grades? All with grade A's. <laughs> You'll be popular, then. <laughs> Anything else we should know about him? His hobbies are mainly sporting ones, and he wants got a hole-in-one in golf. Did he? Mm. And I hear when you were very young, something really interesting happened to you when he was a little baby. Oh, he was on ugly pills. He was the ugliest baby ever born. Somebody had to have been giving him pills to make him that ugly. <laughs> Never was really born that ugly. You weren't meant to tell him. No, I can believe it. So, tell me about Sally, then. Well, she's my aunt. She is a market manager in Camden Town, London. Yeah. She once played backgammon with meatloaf. <laughs> oh, hold on. wasn't it easy to beat a bit of meat? Wasn't it like easy playing like a bit of meatloaf? Wasn't it like easy to beat it? It was very difficult. Was it? Well, what we was both it? filled up the whole room between us. <laughs> <laughs> what was he like? Large, but very, very nice. Did you snog him? No. Oh, all right. Come on to the show, <laughs> Sally and Jonathan. <laughs> never, never, not us. Never, us. Not us. Hello, hello, Francis. Hello, hello Amanda. Hello. Francis, tell me about Amanda. Uh, this is Amanda, my granddaughter. She's yes. 15. Mm -hmm. She's an RAF cadet. Her ambition is to be a policewoman. Really? Yeah. Why? <laughs> Interesting. Work, to arrest with people. Public. Working with the public and yeah. arresting them. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> the so, ones. so, how about your grand then? Well, it's my grandma. She's 57 from Bolton. Straight in with the A's. That's not good enough, is it? She's 57, she's really old, and she picks her nose. Straight in with the, straight in with the horrible stuff. Anything else? Uh, she's got a lovely personality. Nah. Likes music, Bee Gees and Josie Flock. About the same age now, aren't they? Those <laughs> she, actually, she actually likes singing as well, does a bit of singing herself. What sort of stuff do you sing? Pop songs. Like what? In what sort of song? Cheating Hearts. Cheating Hearts. OK, I'll tell you what we'll do, oh. right? I'll be the backing singer, and you sing Cheating Heart. Pick a key, pick a key. Your no, no, pick a key. What key? What key? G, I think. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Your cheating heart. Ba dum ba da ba da ba ba da ba. Will make you weep. Ba da ba da ba ba da ba ba da ba. You cry and cry. Wa 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 wa. And try to sleep. Da ba da ba ba da ba ba da ba. But sleep won't come. Ba ba da ba ba da ba ba da ba. The whole night through. Da 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 da. Your cheating heart. Da 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 da. Will tell on you. Back in distance. Well, that's all we have time for on this show. Join us soon for some more Family Catchphrase. Now we've got the brainy, the brainy against the singer. And if you play, well, you can win yourself this. A wonderful portable CD player, plus a terrific Interpeak mountain bike. Francis. I can see you on that mountain bike, singing your songs. Riding back to Bolton. <laughs> Riding back to Bolton. <laughs> Riding back to Bolton. Right, OK, yeah, then. You know, we're going to show you catchphrases, and you guess what they are. It couldn't be simple. But first of all, we're going to find out how much each of the catchphrases are worth. So, Sally and Jonathan, you won the toss. Hit your buzzer and stop it on a high one if you can. Each one's worth 40. Very good. <laughs> now, don't forget... You are not allowed to buzz until you hear this noise. It's like a bell on a bike. <laughs> All right, are you ready? Here comes your first family catchphrase. <laughs> Sally and Jonathan. Red October. It is Red October. 
So you draw the first blood, 40 plays nothing, and you get the first go at the bonus. And the bonus is worth 50. Behind our nine squares is a bonus catchphrase. Take away a square and try and guess what it is. Bottom middle. Five seconds, what do you think it is? Strawberries dancing. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Strangely enough, that's not right. Here's your next catchphrase. <laughs> Tell me what's on the screen. Francis and Amanda. Laughing hockey sticks. <laughs> 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 Laughing hockey sticks is not right. Sally and Jonathan. Jolly hockey sticks. Of course it is. It's jolly hockey sticks. <laughs> Happy, what was it? What did you say? Laughing hockey sticks. Laughing hockey sticks, <laughs> says the future policewoman. <laughs> okay, now 80 plays nothing, and you get to go now for the bonus. It's worth 45 now, Sally and Jonathan, so take away a square. <laughs> Bottom right, five seconds. What is it? It's not strawberries. Strawberry jam? It's not strawberries, I say so. You say strawberry jam. Okay, great. I can't believe it. I try and help, and they ignore me sometimes. Here's another catchphrase. <laughs> Amanda. Knuckle sandwich. He's right. Knuckle <laughs> sandwich. The audience is trying to get on your side because you're going to be a policewoman. Yeah. <laughs> They're ingratiating in case you pull them up for speeding sometime. And they say, no, no, I was there when you said knuckle sandwich. Okay, carry on. <laughs> Thank you. Have I got the bonus? Take a square away. Oh, the middle square. This could do it for you. Five seconds. What is it? Burning jarred. Burning jarred. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to know the time of the police. Come. No, it isn't. Before he plays 80, here comes another one. <laughs> Sally Jonathan. Two wrongs don't make a right. You're right. <laughs> Two wrongs don't make a right. Yeah, look, look at that, you see? They were clapping when you got that one right, and you haven't been clapping when they get one right. Because they're very good sports, you see. <laughs> Little tip for you there. 40 plays 120. Take a square away and go for the bonus. It's worth 35 now. <laughs> Middle left. Five seconds. What is it? Guard flame. Guard flame is not right, and can the audience please not shout it out? <laughs> I can hear that you know it, but don't tell them. Francis and Amanda, you're back in now. Here's another one for you. <laughs> Sally and Jonathan. Egg and chips. It is egg and chips. Yeah, Mr. Chips. <laughs> now, this bonus is sort of alluding you to, isn't it? But I've got a feeling that Francis knows what it is, don't you? Free? Yeah, you see, Francis and Amanda knows, so you better get it this time. It's worth 30. Take away a square. <laughs> Bottom left, this should do it now. Five seconds, what is it? Fire guard. It is, of course, fire guard. <laughs> Feel a bit daft now, huh? Hot guard and burning guard, fire guard. 190, plays 40. Sally Jonathan, you're in the lead, but now it's head to head. Jonathan, you're going up against Amanda in the solo shoot catchphrases. But first of all, we need to find out how much catchphrases are worth now. So hit the number chase button. <laughs> 60, which is very good for you, because it'll take her longer to catch up. Here comes catchphrase. Jonathan. Two unlimited. It is. Two unlimited. <laughs> Amanda, did you know that? No. Have you heard of them? Yeah. Yeah, have you heard of them, Francis? No. No? They're, they're, they're a bit like Joseph Locke. A oh. little bit, but it's all right. <laughs> 250 plays 40, and you get to go for the bonus again, Jonathan. Take a square away. It's worth 100 now. Top one, you got top middle. Five seconds, what is it? Oh, dear, no. I'm amazed you can't get it just from that. <laughs> no, it's too early, isn't it? Yeah. Too early. So Sally and Francis take over now. OK. It won't be a modern pop group, I promise you that. Um, uh, Francis, it won't be a modern pop group, all right. 
It'd be something you'd be like, be like Rob Wilton or something. All right, you'd be okay. Who's that? Who's that? <laughs> you know, the day war broke out. <laughs> okay, fine. Here you go. Here's a catchphrase. <laughs> Yes, Sally. Bottom drawer. Bottom drawer is right. <laughs> and it's your go at the bonus. It's worth 90 now. Take away a score. Bottom left. Five seconds, what is it? Carpet disc. Carpet disc. <laughs> no. <laughs> Not at all. All right, back to Amanda and Jonathan. Here you go. Venus flytrap. Yes! <laughs> you see, anything a bit aggressive and she gets it. <laughs> In training there. You get to go at the bonus now. 100 plays 310. Try and get that middle square for me. It's worth 80 this time. Five seconds, what is it? Compact disc. No. No, it's not compact disc because that's not a compact disc. That's what gave it away to me. Let's get the score, shall we? Florence and Amanda have got a um, hundred, but in the lead with three tenors, Sally and Jonathan. <laughs> we'll take a break and we'll see you soon for more Family Catchphrase. Don't go away. Welcome back to Family Catch for a Sally and Jonathan at the moment are in the lead, but now it's Sally and Francis carrying on on the solo shoot. Now, come on, Francis, we want you to get this one. Ready, Sally? <laughs> Here we go. Here's your solo catchphrase. <laughs> Sally! Oyster bed. It is oyster bed. <laughs> And you get a go-up bonus now. It's down to 70. Take away a square. It's not compact disc. Five seconds, what is it? Slip disc. Slip disc. You're far too clever for this show. No, that would have been great, but that's not what it is. <laughs> too clever, you see. So it's Jonathan and Amanda taking over. You ready? Here you go. Jonathan, what's on the screen? Three little pigs. It is three little pigs. <laughs> 12 30, you have to now. And just for a change, your team can have a go at the bonus. Here it comes. Um, top left. Five seconds, what is it? Long player. Long player? No, that's not it. So back to Sally and Francis. Ready? You're right, Francis. Yes, thank you. You having a good time? Yes. Why, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Here comes your catchphrase. <laughs> For Rances! Venus in blue jeans. It's your seed, yes! <laughs> For a minute, I thought you were going to sing it then. <laughs> now it's your go at the bonus. 50. Can you get it? Will the audience go potty? Go on, that middle square. Get the middle square, Francis. No, you got bottom right. Might help you, though. Five seconds. What is it? Record player. <laughs> no, not record player. Back to Jonathan and Amanda. Here comes your catchphrase. What's Mr Chips doing? Amanda? Flowing on the pipe. I'm going to give you its blowpipe. I'll give it a yes. Blowpipe's right. <laughs> blowpipe right on the pipe. It's 220 plays 430. You're catching up now. If you can get that middle square, I think you might get this bonus. I've got a lot of confidence in you, Amanda. So <laughs> press the button. Top left you got. Take it away. Five seconds. What's the bonus? Record bed. <laughs> Record. Bed. <laughs> Record bed. <laughs> Strangely enough, that's not absolutely right. Because there isn't a catchphrase called Record Bed. 
<laughs> Otherwise, we might have given it to you. So over to Sally and Francis. You're on a, you're on a winning streak now, Francis. Here comes a catchphrase. <laughs> Sally, straight in there. Living from hand to mouth. Of course it is. <laughs> Living from hand to mouth. <laughs> and we all want to know, will anybody ever get this bonus catchphrase? <laughs> it's now down to 30. Go on, Sally. Take it away and tell what it is. Record sleeve. Of course it is. Record sleeve, you got it! <laughs> See, Crisis on Amanda, it's easy when you're told, isn't it? Yeah, you see, it's obvious. Yeah. Suddenly, boom, hits you in the head. So, 520 plays 220, but now it gets fast and furious. We take away that buzzer, and you can play as soon as you want. Just buzz in there. But first of all, hit the number chase button, Jonathan on Sally, and pick a number. One, three, five. That's high. This will help Francis and Amanda catch up really quickly if you let them in. Here comes your first fast and furious catchphrase. <laughs> Oh, very quick. Sally. Daisy chain. Daisy chain is not right. Karen revealing it. Buzz in as soon as you want, still. Whenever you feel like it. <laughs> Sally and Jonathan again. Flower power. It is flower power. <laughs> Francis, for a minute then, I thought you were about to buzz in, but you sort of stopped yourself halfway. Mm. What happened? Mm. Oh, God, it's so daisy flowers. <laughs> It would have got a lot if you should have done, you see, but it helped. 655 plays 220, and it's worth 200 the bonus now. So take a square away, Sally and Jonathan. Bottom left. Five seconds, what is it? Tiger's tail. Tiger's tail, no, you see, that's, it's a bit of a tail. It could have been, but it isn't. Francis, this time, if you've got any inkling, just buzz in. We just want to hear from you. Oh, right. All right, here it comes now. <laughs> Tell me what's on the screen. What's just happened? What can you see? Francis! Squash battery. Squash battery is not right. Sally and do you want? Yes? Battery charger. Battery charger is not right. Any other goes, Amanda? No, it was flat battery. Oh. All right, OK, all right. It's not my fault. <laughs> Here comes another one. Francis. Undercover. Undercover's not right. Jonathan. Taking cover. Taking cover's right, yeah. <laughs> Taking cover. The bonus is worth 185. You have another go at it now if you want, Sally and Jonathan. Bottom. Middle. Five seconds. What is it? Top hat. Cat. Top cat. Top cat's not right, no. Francis and Amanda. Sally and Jonathan, here comes another one. <laughs> Sally. Stopping the rot. Stopping the rot, right. Mr Tips came on and he stopped the rot. <laughs> we sort of can't stop you two, can we? You're sort of in... Have you been practising at home or something? <laughs> here's, here's the go at the bonus. Taking two squares away, take another one off. <laughs> Stop right. Five seconds, what is it? Flower pot. No, your face is great, Fazzelli. You're sort of, what on earth can it be? Calling funny faces. You get another go now, Francis and Amanda. Come on, here it comes. <laughs> Francis! End to end. End to end's not right. You can buzz him whenever you want. Making Sally's ends meet. Jump. What? Making ends meet. Making ends meet is right. <laughs> the bonus is now worth one five five. You get one more go at it. Take a square off. <laughs> Pull that funny face, Sally. Five seconds. <laughs> what is it? Top hat and tails. It is top hat and tails. <laughs> this team are very, very good. <laughs> okay, so aha. Now, that noise means it's the end of the game. It was a very close fought race. <laughs> Nail biting stuff. Ron and Amanda have got 220, but our winners with 1,215 are Sally and Jonathan.
Look at that. You see, isn't it? Oh, careful. Isn't it good to see nice? It's good to see nice losers, isn't it? Okay, maybe it's not. So you take it with you. You get your family catchphrase sweatshirt, and you also get, of course, the Brewer's Concise Dictionary of Phrase and Fable, published by Helicon. But okay, super champs. Catchphrase genii. Sally and Jonathan, come and play super catchphrase. Hi, <laughs> right, well done. Oh, you're tall, aren't you? You're tall. Thanks, well, yeah. this'll be easy for you. Nothing to it. We've got 25 squares between A and Y. Behind each of those is a catchphrase that you've got to solve. If you can do it in any of the ways the computer's showing you now, any of these lines, then you win this prize. A state-of-the-art portable CD player with superb digital quality sound. It comes complete with in-car accessories and personal earphones. Plus this terrific Townsend Interbeak mountain bike with 15-speed index gears and lightweight alloy wheels. Made to your frame size by Bike City. Well, you know what? The way you two destroyed the opposition, I think you're M squares, aren't you? M square goer for us, I think. And if you can go through the M square in any of these directions, then you win tonight's mega mystery prize. And it is. <laughs> so worth having, huh? Don't tell her. <laughs> You've got 60 seconds to do it in. If you get stuck, say pass, and we can return to that catchphrase. We all want you to do this. Are you ready? Good luck. Your time starts now. M. Playing, playing up and down. Playing up is right. H. S sledge. Sleigh run. Sledge what? Mm. Sledgehammer. Sledge Sledgehammer's right. C. Dragon. Dragonfly. Nope. Wait, the dragon. What's just happened? Dragon split. No. Split dragon. Do you want to say pass and move on? Pass. pass. Oh. In right, the way? Right way. Right of way's right. W. Water. What? What? Water, water bed. blanket. Water bed. No. Water. Water the bed. No. What's happening? Watering. Mm. Watering the blanket. Now, do you want to go back to the one you missed? Go Pass. back. C. Back to C. Now, tell me what Dragon. you can see. Mm. Oh no! It's so annoying because you said all the words are not the right mm. words. Let's show you what you missed. Here's the first one that we didn't get. This was a dragon, and what happens to it? It gets snapped. It's snapped, snap dragon. dragon. Mm. And W square, behind that W square was this one, and you're going to kick yourselves here. It's a blanket, and it becomes wet. It was a wet blanket. Oh. But you know what? Heck, it was only a wonderful prize. That's all. Who cares? <laughs> you get a consolation prize, you get this. You'll take the whole family for a fabulous day out to Thorpe Park. Whether you prefer rides like Logger's Leap or Flying Fish, there's entertainment for everyone here, young and old. That'll be all right. <laughs> that thing on the... Uh, the thing on the parachute looks good. I thought I got that thing on the parachute. You've been great. Thank you for playing the game. You've been wonderful. Thanks for watching. We'll see you soon for some more Family Catchphrase. Bye-bye. <laughs>